Hello everyone. Today, we're exploring the therapeutic uses and important considerations of a medication known as magnesium sulfate, commonly available under brand names like Epsom salt among others. As always, this session is for educational purposes, and it's crucial to consult a healthcare provider for personal medical advice. Description Magnesium sulfate, also recognized under brand names such as Epsom salt, is a chemical compound that serves multiple medical purposes. It is administered in various forms, including as an oral solution, an injectable solution, and as granules for soaking. This medication is essential in treating and preventing low blood magnesium levels in the body. Its uses extend to managing seizures in women with eclampsia, a severe complication of pregnancy characterized by high blood pressure. Additionally, it is employed in the treatment of torsades de points, a specific type of abnormal heart rhythm, and as a laxative for short-term relief of constipation. The versatility of magnesium sulfate also includes its application in treating asthma attacks by relaxing the bronchial muscles and in soaking baths to relieve muscle soreness and reduce swelling. Warnings Magnesium sulfate must be used under medical supervision, especially in injectable forms, due to the potential for serious side effects or complications. It is not recommended for individuals with severe kidney disease due to the risk of magnesium toxicity. Special caution should be exercised when it is used during pregnancy, especially in the first trimester, as it may pose risks to the fetus. The use of magnesium sulfate as a laxative should not extend beyond a week unless directed by a healthcare provider to avoid electrolyte imbalance and dependency. Before taking this medicine, before starting magnesium sulfate, it's vital to inform your healthcare provider about any existing health conditions, especially kidney disease, as this could significantly affect the safety and efficacy of the medication. If you are pregnant, planning to become pregnant, or breastfeeding, discuss the potential risks and benefits with your doctor. Inform your healthcare provider about any other medications you are taking, including over-the-counter drugs, to prevent possible interactions. Side Effects Side effects of magnesium sulfate can vary based on the route of administration. When taken orally or used in a bath, it may cause stomach upset, diarrhea, or skin irritation. Injectable magnesium sulfate can lead to more severe side effects, such as respiratory depression, low blood pressure, confusion, heart rhythm abnormalities, and muscle weakness. Immediate medical attention is required if any signs of allergic reaction or severe side effects occur. Interactions Magnesium sulfate may interact with other medications, especially those that affect kidney function or alter electrolyte balance. It's important to discuss all current medications with a healthcare provider to avoid adverse interactions. Dosage The correct dosage of magnesium sulfate depends on its intended use, the individual's age, and their overall health condition. For constipation, a typical oral dose might involve dissolving a specific amount in water as directed. In medical settings, dosages for injections or infusions are carefully calculated based on the specific condition being treated. Always follow the dosage and administration instructions provided by a healthcare professional. Avoid. When using magnesium sulfate, especially as a laxative or in soaking baths, staying hydrated is essential. Individuals should avoid using more than the recommended amount to prevent potential side effects like diarrhea or electrolyte imbalance. FAQ. A common question about magnesium sulfate involves its safety for children. The use in children, especially for laxative purposes, should be under the guidance of a healthcare provider to ensure safety and effectiveness. Closing That concludes our overview of magnesium sulfate. This guide aims to provide a comprehensive understanding but is not a substitute for professional medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare provider for personalized information and before starting any new treatment. Thank you for joining us.